Wave at the camera. Wave. Yeah. Good morning, explorers. We're back. Our Comic Con days are behind us. We're now going to set out and explore Vienna. Um, if you didn't see the Comic Con videos, go back and check them out. I think they're quite good. Uh, but today, we're going to be going to some comic book stores. The uh, Stevenson Cathedral. We'll work on the pronunciation of that. Uh, what are we doing there, Reese? Uh, we're going to try and conquer my fears and go to the very top. We're going to finish off the day by going to the Armoury Museum. Uh, we're not going to try and pronounce that one at the moment. We'll figure out how to pronounce it later on. So we're going to get our stuff together and we're going to head out. So we just got out of Collector's Corner. Um, I've done a purchase, got a woolly hat, which will be handy because it's been repeatedly reminded to me. My head's lacking, my head's lacking a bit of hair. Yeah, thank you, Reese. I just couldn't bring myself to say it. Um, but yeah, we just got speaking to the person who runs this shop. He's been at the convention all weekend. The stores are absolutely packed. Um, if you come to Vienna, I'd highly recommend checking out Collector's Corner. Um, he gave me a bit of a discount on my hat because he's such a nice guy. Um, but yeah, awesome shot. Uh, apparently they sell loads of comics. We couldn't see the comics because they hadn't been unpacked in the convention. Um, but we couldn't figure out where on earth all the comics would actually even go. But yeah, just tons of stuff there. Really good store. We've just come out of our second comic book store of the day. Uh, this one's Comics Hutterer. Uh, they're a bit iffy about filming in there, so discreetly got a few shots. So if anything you see looks a bit dodgy, it's because that's being very discreet. It's an alright shop. Uh, I didn't buy anything. Um, I don't need anything because I've just got this, this lovely hat. outside Stephenson Ween. Uh, hopefully we're saying that right. Uh, it was quite a wow moment coming around the corner. This building's huge, it's very spectacular. Uh, do you want to drop a bit of knowledge on us, Reese? Um, yeah, so it is the most important religious uh, building in the whole of Vienna. Yeah, it's a Roman Catholic uh, cathedral. Uh, like I say, it looks amazing on the outside. Let's head in and see how good it looks on the inside. <laughs> guys have been watching the last videos you'll see that um, from the Vassar Museum that I'm not the fondest of heights. Um, I'm going to attempt again to try and get over my fear but it doesn't look like it's going to happen. Oh, yeah. Being very brave. Yes. So we made it 
to the top of the lift brought us all the way to the top. Um, it wasn't an open lift as well, so I'm pretty thankful for that. Um, so this is where we are, if you want to have a go at trying to pronounce I think it's pronounced as Stephensden Ween. Probably wrong. <laughs> um, but yeah, we're not too sure how hard we are at the moment. I mean, as you can see by the lovely blue that uh, view that Richard's going to pan out to now. <laughs> So there's one more floor to go to now and then we're going to try and conquer that, but um, so far so good, I haven't uh, passed out yet. We're at the very top. Um, how are you feeling, Reese? Um, I'm more comfortable than I was at the Vassar Museum, guys. Um, so uh, that's a reason to go back and look at, look at the other videos that me and Geek Explorer Richard has made. Um, yeah, the this <laughs> Stevens Dum Ween um, <laughs> is a really great building. <laughs> Uh, it's been it's free to come into the first part and have a look around and just the views inside are spectacular and the outdoor outside's amazing um, and then it's only six euros to come up here so I'd really recommend checking this out. Great selfie point as well so if you're a sucker for the selfies for the Instagram I would highly recommend. Yeah there's loads of people up here just photoing themselves and the view. Really good. Lock us. <laughs> Successfully conquered Stevenston Ween. Uh, Reese, are you feeling good? Yeah, pretty good. It's been fun. Um, we're heading back down. We're going to go see the other sites of Vienna. So, in the distance, you can see that big wheel. It's called the Renenstad. I think that's how it's pronounced. We're going to be going there in one of our upcoming videos. Uh, another opportunity for Reese to go up high. excited to just be indoors. Uh, it's only about three or four in the afternoon. The temperature's really dropped. It's very chilly now. Are you enjoying the temperature? Nope. <laughs> All right, yeah, we're gonna get inside. <laughs> in the warmth we're in the Imperial Armoury Museum. Reese is keeping me extra warm. Um, this museum uh, is, is located in the museum quarter of Vienna. Uh, it contains uh, lots of different armors, lots of weapons. Uh, we're going to be learning at the same time as you are so let's check it out. <laughs> an unusual part of armour. I think you can see what I'm talking about. I didn't know that um, armour had that bit, but it's good to know that, that's, that your whole body is protected. Okay, it looks like there's a bit of a problem today and we're not going to be doing very much learning. Um, all of the exhibits are all in German. Um, so we're going to have to just look at things and decide for ourselves what they are. Also one thing as well, um, a nice surprise, so uh, we come here expecting that it's just going to be Australian, Austrian weapons etc. Turns out they've got some English ones here as well. If you just uh, look at these right here, some <laughs> English guns. <laughs> Sorry if they're shaking. <laughs> 
find the information out in English that you want to know so you need to download an app um, a helpful guy told us about it um, unfortunately we haven't really got enough data on our phones to download it and I haven't even got any space on my phone um, and a second bit of knowledge is um, all of the exhibits um, have got like an alarm around them so if you get too close an alarm goes off so you can photo them and look at them but from far away so don't touch <laughs> See here, they've got armour for all different shapes and sizes and heights. This armour's actually got some English information next to it. Um, it was sent to the King of Poland when he got married. Um, it doesn't really make it clear if it's a wedding gift or if it's worn at the wedding. It just says it's costume armour, but presumably it's for his wife. Alright guys, we're going to leave you here, we've just left the museum, it's been a good time, I would recommend coming here, but I'd say definitely download the app before you come so you can understand what on earth all the exhibits are about. Reese, got any thoughts? Uh, yeah, I mean, I, reckon, I enjoyed it, but it would have been more enjoyable if I knew what half the things were. Yeah, it all looked fantastic. Um, our knowledge level has not increased, but it was good fun. Um, if you've enjoyed watching this video, check back next week. Uh, we'll have our final Vienna vi Yeah, we're in Vienna. Sorry, I thought we were in Stockholm for a second. We're in Vienna, Austria. Uh, so we'll have our final Vienna video next week. <coughs> uh, if you enjoyed this, um, please subscribe, leave a comment, do a like, and we'll see you soon.